Good morning, YouTube! I have seen a number of you on motorhome internet forums complaining of a stiff or sticky gear change on your Fiat Ducato based motorhome. Now, if you have difficulty moving your gear lever, getting into or out of one or more gears, then watch the next few minutes and try this because while your friend on the forum's advice that he had exactly the same problems as you and it cost him thousands of pounds for a new gearbox is a no doubt well intentioned, your problem is far more likely to be just a simple lack of lubrication which you can sort out yourself for next to nothing. You are going to need an assistant. My assistant is called Millie, but yours can be called whatever you want. You will find a torch helpful. You are going to need some WD-40 or similar type penetrating lubricant. And if this cures your problem, you're going to want a little bit of grease to stop the problem coming back again in the future. So, on the command of wiggle, Millie is going to wiggle the gear lever. She's just going to move it side to side in neutral and into and out of gear as best as she can. Okay, ready? Three, two, one, wiggle. You come with me and we'll have a look inside the engine bay. Now the engine is off. Millie is wiggling the gear lever. And if we look down there, so as we're looking into the engine bay, this is a 2006 onwards model of Ducato. If you have the earlier model, it'll look slightly different in here, but the idea is much the same. So as we look in here, next to the engine, to the right, the next thing that over here to the right, connects to the engine, that is the gearbox. Now, if we look in there, that the thing you can see moving is the linkage that connects the wiggling of Millie's arm to the input selector shaft of the gearbox. And as you can see, it's in a fairly exposed position. It gets a lot of spray off the wheels and it gets quite a lot of salt on it in the winter. And that's why this is a problem that you see motorhome owners complaining about more than van owners because the works van tends to get used every day. So it doesn't get the chance to corrode up. The problem you're having on your motorhome is that when you leave it parked in the winter, that joint is getting quite corroded up. It's not helped by the fact it leaves the factory fairly dry. So we're going to take our penetrating spray, our WD-40 type spray, get in there as best we can. Obviously it's pretty hard to see with the camera as well, and my arm in there and a torch and everything, but basically just give all those moving surfaces, all those ball joints, a damn good dousing while your assistant wiggles. Millie, how's that feeling? Much better? There we go, okay. And you might need to work it backwards and forwards a few times, but eventually that should get your linkage working. If that helps, once you've got it all sorted, drop your torch down inside the engine bay, get yourself a coat and a grease, and put that all over those linkages to finish the job off, because the WD-40 is just a thin oil, so basically the first time it rains, that's all just gonna get washed off again. The solvent will evaporate off and you'll be back where you started. So just give that, those joints a good coat and a grease, And that should be you sorted out for the rest of your life. Good luck. See you soon. Thanks. Bye.